Now we're taking a look at Brightcom's administration of endpoints. Endpoints can be telepresence systems, conference rooms, laptops, desktops, and other manufacturers equipment such as a Cisco system or maybe an MCU and that could either be a direct connection or a NATed connection depending on how you're getting access to the network. Now when creating a new connection we can decide what type of connection that it is. We can give it a direct SIP address to connect to it. We can also decide what the proper requirements are for the type of connection. Things such as the amount of bandwidth that's going to be necessary both for upload and download. We can also work within the virtual rooms. So as users connect to the system, we can give them the opportunity to use fe certain features or in some cases restrict features from certain types of meetings. Now this can be very useful because it can be applied uh, to the room itself or these features can also be applied to individual users or groups of users to help manage the experience of the, of the meeting that's necessary. Once all your settings have been set, you simply hit save and the next time the users connect, they will have this opportunity to work with them.